everyone, welcome back. In this video, we are going to discuss about what is automatic batch transfer. Before moving on to the automatic batch transfer, we need to know what is batch transfer. Batch transfer is a process of moving a group of product or batch of product from one location to another location. So automatic batch transfer is a process of moving a group of product or batch of product without any normal intervention. So let's see how can we manage the automatic batch transfer in Odoo 17 inventory module. So we can manage the automatic batch transfer based on different criteria, such as it can be based on contacts, it can be based on locations or um, the carrier or source location. So let's walk through an example. Let's say we all are frequent online purchasers. Let's imagine you have made multiple orders of item and all these items are going to arrive on same day. In this case, the logistics will do that. They will just group the items that they need to deliver into your location. So let's see how we are going to manage the automatic batch transfer in Odoo 17. To manage with the batch transfer, you can just move on to the inventory module and we have to enable the batch transfer from the configuration settings that would allow to process the transfers um, in batch per worker and once we have enabled this we know that we would batch a process during the delivery of the item to the customers so to manage with the batch transfer you can just move on to the operation types and here you can choose the operation type as delivery orders so here you can see that we have enabled the automatic batch transfers and we can just group the transfers based on contact, carrier, destination, country, as well as source location. So if you want to just enable everything, you can enable that. And here we are going to set a maximum lines per batch to be three. So even if a customer is ordering for four or five uh, items and the arrival of these items is on a same day, uh, what the delivery man will do is that they will batch all the items. Just consider uh, there is a uh, arrival of six items to the customer. So in that case, the uh, delivery man will batch um, the item into two as well as each batch will be having a three of items each. And here we are going to set a maximum transfer uh, per batch as five and we can also set the maximum weight that to be carried in a batch and auto confirm is a button that is uh, used to confirm the batch otherwise the batch will be created in trad state so once you have just uh, created the automatic confirmation you can just move on to the sales module to proceed with your orders so currently we don't have any orders and we have to uh, create the orders from the scratch here i'm gonna choose the customer over here and let's choose the product uh, and we have to just confirm the order but we don't need to deliver the item because we will be delivering the item to the customer in a batch now let's create another order by choosing the same customer itself and let me uh, choose another product over here and you can set the quantity that to be uh, yeah set and you can just confirm the order and we have to just create multiple orders for the same customer because here we're gonna just batch the product that is based on the contact now yeah well we are going to choose the con i mean set the quantities and everything now let's confirm afterwards let's create three more uh, package that is orders for the customer well you can choose other products from the list and let's confirm that and here we're gonna just uh, create an order of clip sandwich or something for the customer and here you can just confirm the order and finally the customer is going to place an order for coca-cola with six quantity so you can choose that product also so here you can just see everything so let me choose the quantity and let's save this and confirm so as we just confirm you can see the delivery uh, operation over here and you can see the batch also and under the batch you can see the items that is wrapped in a batch so either you can just deliver the item uh, directly to the customer uh, from here so here you can see that uh, actually here we have two batches we have just made an order for the customer with six um, sales order 
okay and uh, here you also need to notice that as we have just enabled the auto confirm button uh, here you can see that the batch has created in in progress state because um, if you are not enabling that the batch will be in its draft state and we have to uh, manually uh, set everything and you can also view the batch under the inventory module and here you can just go to the uh, operations and choose batch transfers and here you can see the batch that is created here we know the same customer has just ordered for six uh, i mean has made a six sales order and each of the batch will be having a uh, three in its line this is because we have limited in such a way now we can just validate the process so once we have just validated you can see we have just delivered the item to the customer now let's back to the other batch and let's validate and we have 10 so here you can view that as we have just validated the batch transfer when you just move on to the sales uh, module to view uh, the orders you can find the inventory valuation also over here under the um, delivery operation and you can see the valuation that is the stock movement and everything can be found over here so this is how we manage with the uh, batch transfer in Udu Senti. So hope this concept is clear for you. As always, stay awesome and thank you for watching the video.